Hey guys, it's Agi. I just wanted to share some quick clips of the longsword block since I was having a hard time finding any info on it. So once I figured it out a bit better, I wanted to make a quick video for people so everyone else can have a decent starting point on making it work for themselves. For a while I thought it was a timing thing, like it was an actual parry, but it's a legitimate block and it's all about weapon positioning and I think uh, spacing between the enemies. So far I think I can reliably block the single sword skellies like in the background and occasionally the guardian skellies, the ones with the shield. Don't forget there's a repost attack after you successfully block. You right click once or twice and you'll hit left and then right. Um, I've blocked a few wraith attacks and a couple skeleton champion attacks too so that's possible. I found there seems to be a sweet spot of about a third of the blade's length that needs to line up with the enemy's attack in order to actually block it. You can see here, it's pretty easy to miss the block on the Guardians to the left of your blade. Um, you have to almost move your whole body left and actually intercept their attack by putting yourself in more of harm's way. But it seems to reliably block that way. So uh, I don't think it's really worth blocking on purpose against these guys. Maybe only if they catch you unaware and you're reacting to it. Just try and move left to line up the blade properly. I'll try and get some clips of blocking the Wraith and the Champion attacks though, since uh, seeing those would probably be pretty helpful for everyone else. Um, I'll also try and get the boys on to help show blocking some player character attacks with the different weapons, since blocking in PvP with the Longsword would be pretty dope. Um, that's it. Thanks for watching. Be safe and good luck in the dungeon. And don't forget, the goddamn <coughs> skeleton archers are overpowered. Bastards.